I'm in a restaurant off O'Connell Street. I'm the last one he has to meet. He walks in, he sits across from me. He says, this is the worst thing you could ever hear from an ex. So many people in Ireland are silent about their status because society has silenced us. Hello there, everybody, and you're all very welcome to another episode of the show. Your semen is dangerous. This is the good news okay. that I've been holding off to now. <laughs> this is the pinnacle of the day. My HIV affects no one. Where's the education skill? It's nowhere. When I tested positive, there was a part of me that just felt like I would lost something that I would never get back. I ended up promising not to tell anyone, and I kept that promise for a decade. <laughs> Secrets are personal, aren't they? Powerful, too. And in the wrong hands, a secret can become a weapon. So maybe sometimes it's best to keep them to yourself. But sickness, I don't know. That's something different. We don't have to be in a closet anymore. We're going to change this country for the thousands of us living with HIV out there. We're taking a stand. We're stuck in this cycle of shame and silence, and we need to break out of it. One, two, three.